Here's a step-by-step -step guide to help you troubleshoot and fix a display port that suddenly stopped working, whether it's due to a hardware issue or a Windows update. Step 1. Check physical connections. Unplug and reconnect the display port cable on both the monitor and GPU or PC. Try a different cable. The cable itself could be faulty. Use a different port. If your GPU has multiple display ports, test another one. Inspect for damage. Look for bent pins, cracked ports, or frayed cables. Step 2. Try another monitor or device. Plug your PC into a different monitor using the same display port, or connect a different PC or laptop to the same monitor with display port. This will tell you if the issue is with the PC or the monitor. Step 3. Check the input source on the monitor. Go into your monitor settings, the OSD menu. Make sure the input source is set to display port, not HDMI or auto. Step 4. Detect display in Windows. First, right-click on your desktop and then click on display settings. Next, scroll down and click detect under multiple displays. If your second display appears, you can configure it as desired, whether you want to extend or duplicate it. Step 5. Reboot and power cycle. To start, turn off both your PC and monitor. Then unplug both from the power source for at least 30 seconds. After that, plug them back in and power them on. Step 6. Update or reinstall GPU drivers. Begin by pressing and choosing Device Manager. Expand Display Adapters, right-click your GPU, and choose Update Driver. Alternatively, you can uninstall the driver and reinstall the latest version from NVIDIA drivers, AMD drivers, or Intel drivers. If this happened after a Windows update, consider rolling back the GPU driver. Right-click on your GPU, go to Properties, then the Driver tab, and click Rollback Driver if it's available. Step 7. Undo the recent Windows update if you suspect it caused the issue. If the problem started right after a Windows update, press and go to Update and Security, then Windows Update. Click on View Update History, and then Uninstall Updates. Remove the most recent feature update or driver update if it's available. Step 8. Boot into safe mode. Sometimes third-party software conflicts with display drivers. Press and type and press enter. Go to the boot tab, check safe boot, and restart your computer. See if your display port works in safe mode. If it does, it's likely a driver or software conflict. Consider doing a clean install of your graphics drivers using DDU, which stands for Display Driver Uninstaller. It's a handy tool you can find online at wagnardsoft.com. Step 9 is to check BIOS or UEFI, especially if you're on a laptop or using integrated graphics. You'll want to enter BIOS or UEFI and make sure the display output is enabled. Or maybe try toggling the GPU priority. It's a good step to ensure everything is set up right. Step 10. Hardware Diagnostic. If none of the above works, test the GPU in a different PC if possible. Or try a different graphics card in your PC. Also, try a different monitor with DisplayPort. If the DisplayPort continues to fail on all systems, the port on the GPU or monitor might be physically damaged. Bonus! Known issues with Windows updates. Some windows. Feature updates have broken external display detection. You can pause updates temporarily or use System Restore to roll back to when DisplayPort was working. Press, type, and follow the prompts. Quick fix summary. Step 1. Reconnect and inspect cables. Step 2. Test with different monitor or PC. Step 3. Set monitor input to display port. Step 4. Detect display in Windows. Step 5. Power cycle monitor or PC. Step 6. Update or reinstall graphics driver. Step 7. Roll back Windows update if needed. Step 8. Use safe mode to check for conflicts. Step 9. Check BIOS or UEFI settings. Step 10. Test for hardware failure.